Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Considering the geography of India, the armed forces have diverse problems and challenges. Indian Army is perhaps the only army in the world which is permanently deployed in the world's highest inaccessible and hostile battlefield such as Siachen and Ladakh. At the altitudes greater than 5500 meters and temperature falling below minus 30 degrees celsius it becomes challenging to supply the essential goods arms and ammunition to our armed forces the logistics becomes risky and time consuming in these areas so hl has come forward with the concept of ruav in aero india 2021 to provide the next generation military logistic supply at higher altitudes they are also called mule drones the RUAV-200 is fully autonomous unmanned helicopter for deployment in hostile and otherwise inaccessible conditions at high altitudes. The RUAV is a coaxial rotor helicopter drone designed to perform various operations such as intelligence, surveillance and reconnaissance operations. It can also aid in operation of tanks, infantry vehicles and artilleries. It will feature lightweight composite structure with fault-tolerant automatic flight control system. Its cargo bay is designed to carry a wide variety of stores and supplies. It will have a surveillance payload in the forward underbelly, which is day and night camera. The camera is primarily used to help crew to guide the drone through mountainous region. Additionally, the camera can also be used for surveillance and reconnaissance. The RUAV follows a modular design which makes its assembly and transportation very easy. It has been designed for high operational availability and less maintainability. Various automatic features such as automatic landing and takeoff of the RUAV makes its operation and handling very easy. Now talking about its uh, specifications, the RUAV has service ceiling of 6000 meter and hovering ceiling of 5500 meters. The 200 kg RUAV will be able to operate at a temperature ranging from minus 35 to 55 degrees Celsius. It has endurance of 4.5 hours. The RUAV will be capable of flying at a top speed of 100 km per hour at an altitude of 6 km. It has a payload of 30 kg at 5.5 km altitude and 80 kg at sea level. It will feature a data link for the communication between RUAV and its GCS that is ground control station having a range of 100 kilometers. The RUAV will most likely be powered by a Wankel engine. A Wankel engine is a type of internal combustion engine using an eccentric rotatory mechanism to convert pressure into rotating motion. Talking about its developmental update, HL has already commenced the procurement of various parts for the rotor system. The rotor system of RUAV consists of main rotor blades, main rotor head and upper control system and tail rotor system. HL is also procuring an autopilot system which will consist of a compatible ground control system for controlling the RUAV and its payload. The first flight of RUAV is planned in the year 2023. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.